Hello everyone, and thank you for being a part of this super special event, the New York Sash Teddy Bear Toss. There is so much work that is involved in this event, and it's such a busy time of year. It's just really important to pause and remember why we're doing this and what is really important to everyone, which is helping other people, making children smile. Um, so much involved in this event, everything from promoting the game, working with the college, with Coach Heenan, with all the various uh, volunteers and the television stations to really put this on. And of course, during the big event, it is always so hectic and so busy, so much buzz and excitement. The stands are full. All of the volunteers are anxiously waiting for Utica University to score that first goal for the teddy bears to fly and for us to pick them up, stuff them into the bags and load them onto the New York Sash truck. But that is really just the beginning. Once the bears leave the ice, get into the bags and into the truck, the truck is brought here to our New York Sash offices where we then have to take on the task of unloading them and getting them ready for their final destination. So it takes many man hours and a lot of volunteers to do this stuff as well. We unbag each and every stuffed animal, lay them out on the floor, we dry them off, we dust them off, make sure that they're nice and clean. We certainly count them so that we're able to provide some feedback to all of the generous donors to let them know what kind of an impact the event has had. But then we go through the process of rebagging the bears to make them available for distribution. So this is our 19th year for the New York Sash Teddy Bear Toss. And what I have on my desk here is just a few of the thank you cards, notes, and drawings that we've received throughout the years. So the thank you cards come from the children and the adults. We have heartfelt thanks from the New York State Police from their Crimes Victims Unit. They thank us for our very generous donation of stuffed animals. They use the animals when working with children who are in crisis or who have been severely traumatized. It is amazing to see how such a small gesture can be soothing and comforting to children in their time of need. We also have things from Mosaic Health. Thank you so much for your efforts with the Teddy Bear Toss game and distribution. It is a wonderful thing your company does and we are all happy to receive stuffed animals. We've got so many cards and also cards from the kids like this one that says, to New York Sash from Alley. I love the teddy bear. I love you. Well, we love you too. In addition to all of these wonderful handwritten notes and cards from teachers and from students, we also get quite a few emails from people who are recipients of the bears. They say things like, we've been doing this yearly for our students. They are low-income families and getting a teddy bear may be one of their only gifts for Christmas. And students are all from low income and most are one parent or immigrant homes. I love seeing their faces when I let them pick a bear. And this last one, we have seen a large increase in requests for assistance, so the bears will go a long way in helping us fill the gaps. So everything from the Neighborhood Center, the Salvation Army, Turning Point Church, and many elementary and middle schools throughout the Mohawk Valley, they are all recipients of these bears, but it all starts with the donation of the game. So we are so thankful for everyone out there who purchased a new stuffed animal, or a stuffed penguin and threw it at the teddy bear toss.